and then there were three. Three Canadian teams in the NHL playoffs and three promising ones at that. You have your Western Conference champions, the Calgary Flames. Last year's Canadian playoff hero, the Winnipeg Jets. And a team with seven 20-goal scorers, the Toronto Maple Leafs. So where would we find your heart amidst the sea of red, the Winnipeg Whiteout, or at Maple Leaf Square? From Manitoba, but you call Ontario home, are you cheering for the Jets or the Leafs? In our household, you have to cheer for both because my <laughs> husband is a long-time Maple Leaf fan and I'm a long-time Jet fan, so we cheer for both. I don't know what we're going to do if they play each other in the final. Well, I'm cheering for the Jets, as you can tell by the white, and I think out of all the Canadian teams, they're the, they're the best one to cheer for because they're not from Toronto and uh, they got the most entertaining team. They made it far last year and we got to finish it this year. So. Well, I'll be cheering for the Leafs, of course, because we're from Toronto and, of course, Calgary because I feel like Calgary's going to go a long way and I think they have a lot of potential this year. Maple Leafs, <laughs> this is the best year we've had in a long time. 2019 is an amazing year. Disappointment, anger and controversy surrounded our Edmonton, Montreal and Ottawa counterparts. The young Canucks took a step forward but couldn't close the playoff gap. So now where do all those fans pledge their playoff allegiance? Uh, Calgary Flames, Alberta, Alberta team and all that. They've got to support Alberta. Well, being a Canadian, I'm gonna, I think I'll go for Winnipeg. Uh, I'm going to say Toronto and Winnipeg. People should just cheer for Canadian teams in general. Without the Habs, it's, uh, it's no one. I might look at Toronto, but uh, very, uh, <laughs> very reluctantly. The Jess, Jabs, and friendly competition abound this year. But our sister station, Sportsnet, has dropped their power rankings, and they give Calgary of the Canadian teams the best shot of winning the cup. They put their chances at eight to one, the Leafs at twenty to one, and the Jets at sixteen to one. We'll see how it all unfolds. In Winnipeg, Stephanie Lasuk, City News.